Hi guys, Dr. Z here, giving you some information for the best care of your neck and back. Glad you tuned in. Today we're going to talk about cervical radiculopathy. Cervical radiculopathy happens in the neck. First of all, the neck is composed of seven vertebral bodies lined up on top of each other. Behind every vertebral body is a nerve root that exits, that goes down a different path of the arm as we see here in the dermatomal map. Most neck problems of this nature occur from pinching of a nerve by either a herniated disc or a bone spur in the cervical spine that leads to pain down the arm, numbness down the arm, and tingling in the arm. That's what we call cervical radiculopathy. The vast majority of these problems are treated with non-operative measures. To relieve this inflammation, we can use things such as physical therapy, chiropractic care, cervical traction, vitamin supplementation with anti-inflammatory supplements that we recommend, anti-inflammatory medication, possible steroid injection in the cervical spine, even some nerve medications. In a very small percentage of people, these conservative measures fail and surgery becomes our last option. Our primary surgery we do for this problem is a cervical disc replacement to relieve the pressure of the herniated disc or the bone spur on the actual nerve root and reduce the radiculopathy effects. We're definitely going to talk about disc replacements in one of our upcoming videos. And for now, thank you for tuning in for the best care of your neck and back.